Hello, hello, it's Keponen here. And today I'm trying out Cloud Climber. So I think this is a game where you go get water for yourself. Otherwise, I don't know anything about this. This is free on Steam. So if you would like to play this before watching me play this, go check it there. And there's another game from Two Stars Gaming here. My beautiful paper smile. If you are interested in that type of games, go check that out too. But we just start the game here. Another day has arrived. I'd best get my water before going to work. Stan Diary, page 1489. I may need to get to the neighboring tower in the future, but I know the other builders keep them entrance keep the entrance to the bridge locked. I saw a key on the table at the top of our tower a few weeks ago before I went to get more building supplies. I haven't been up there in a few days, so I'll need to check it check if it unlocks the bridge door. If the other towers ever became vacant, I might need to get across, so I'll have to keep this in mind. Okay, chest key opens this and we get a bucket of water. Oh, I thought we are going to get a water, but we already have and that's just empty bucket. Okay, this door doesn't open. Okay, so this has, I think... Construction on the last tower stopped weeks ago. I can only assume that the builders have met their fate by now. I believe it's safe enough for me to go and continue building higher yet from where they left off. Okay. I'll need I... to travel across the other two towers to get there, but I'm sure I can find a way. I can't run. So I think the developer probably has drawn these graphics himself. I'm probably doing the voice acting too. Bernie the Great and Terrible Lyra page 69. For months we have been building faster than ever. Yet it seems as if every time we complete a new level the clouds rise higher and higher. I could have so sworn we were close to the decades ago, but we're still not done yet. I can only hope that we are getting close. Signed, Bernie the Great and Terrible. Why is he great and terrible? No, are we just going up? I think we need to get like there or there. So let's keep going. Maybe use a little oil on these doors. Joey Diary, page 420. I've been building all day long, and Bernie, the great and terrible, has been sitting on his butt acting a Foreman, aka he doesn't do any work and drinks all our water. I've started locking my water chest just in case he really does think he's above us all. Okay. So we are just living in this tower and everybody has like a one room for themselves. Is there anything like lower there? Is there even like a earth, ground, anything? Is it just nothingness. Oh, so if I can get up there, I mean in there, we can go there, but I can jump, I can run. Yeah, yeah, we are almost on top. There's tools, the key, bridge door. Okay, so it's probably one, one level down back here. Right in here. Yes. There's Petrol and Edna, Diary page 36. I can't believe today is the 100th anniversary of our tower. I know others have been building much longer, and now I wish our grandparents had taken this whole thing more seriously. 100 years ago they decided things were getting dangerous, but why didn't they see the problem 200 years ago, or even longer? I'm still glad they started building, but I just wish we had seen this coming. Yeah, so bit like a it's climate quite some time since change. I was on the second tower I haven't crossed this bridge since the builders became greedy and took the supplies that were meant to come to our tower just like all the other towers its inhabitants quickly grew desperate and aggressive 
Okay. Now it stands empty. Oh, I tire patch spot five. I guess I knew this day would come, but I didn't expect it to come this soon. Yesterday we started extreme rationing of our water. A few days back when back we stopped getting supplies from the ground crew on our lift. So there is something on the ground. We can only assume that they stole the supplies for themselves, ran out of water and food sources, or simply died. If we don't get into the cloud soon, we might need to see if we can get some from one of the neighboring towers. So, are we, like, trying to get to the clouds for the water? Like, the water is running low on ground level for some reason, and that's why we are trying to get, like, not have a key for that. Like, trying to get water straight from the clouds or something. Bertha, diary page, 9825. Dear diary, wouldn't it be ironic if it rained now, after decades of building? Now would be the perfect time since we've just started rationing our supplies more, but I have a good feeling about things. I know i never seen a rain myself, but grandmother always told me how wonderful it felt. It would be surreal to be on the ground and see water for miles, instead of desert and wasteland. I'm sure it will rain someday, we just need to survive until then. Yeah, okay, so there is no water on the ground level because it hadn't haven't installed a rope cart on this low range a long time. Tower. I should be able to use it to get across. Okay, let's try to bring the platform here. Us. I haven't seen anything useful, or then I have missed something, but I... Why, how do I... Do I go one level down? Just do it by hand? This was the bird, all right? No, it's Kyle. I tried to be reasonable. I tried to talk with them, but those greedy little scumbags on Tower 1 don't want to share their supplies with us. I'm not going to die miles up off the ground. Dying up like a ration, while other people watch. I'm going over there tonight to take everything I need, so I can last long enough to watch everyone else die. Kyle, you son of a gun. Okay, here's the crank. We are pretty high. Couple towers up. A little, more, a little bit more higher, I think. Um... Do I see something red? Oh, it's just a torn banner. How do I get... Do I cut this rope? Oh! Now it's just suddenly... Okay. Just could almost to... call this place beautiful if these dust storms weren't so suffocating. Okay, is there more like... Dust on the ground level so nobody can... Like, I live there. It's all desert and wasteland. Tower. Fourth. Oh, there's a page here. That's probably just wind. Show it, diary page 556. Yesterday, Haran fell off the tower. Oh my. I don't know how it happened, but it was a shame. Especially since he had the key to most of our water chests. We'll need to break the locked ones open soon, since we've almost emptied other chests. I really hope that that sound is... Just the wind. I can't go there. Wait, there's a diary page here too. Ah, oh, dang. Diary page one. I couldn't be more frustrated right now. We're running out of water, running out of building supplies, and Carl just won't get along with me. At least five times a day he pretends he's going to push me off the tower. I swear, if I do fall someday, it will be, it will be his fault. Yeah, maybe he then went and pushed him down. Paul, I can just get, I just can't get over it. Adam gives me the absolute best reactions when I mess with him. For the past week, I've been pretending to get mad at show and show my arms at him, as if to push him off the tower. I don't think this will ever get old. And I can tell Hadang loves it. But a good guy. 
Okay, hopefully I didn't miss too many pages. There's a chest, but I can't find the keys. Some of them seems to be lost. Looks like I'll need to fix this bridge. Right. So well, let's try to find a couple planks. Well, it just looked like I could jump over it because it was like a this small hole, but whatever. Like there's one blank missing. I can't jump. Don't say I have to go back. Wait, can I take these from here? Like this? No. Dang it. Hmm. Okay, so do I have to go back to the other tower because there doesn't seem to be anything here? No, okay, they were here. I could just take them from here, so. Okay. Hopefully this is all I need. Wow, nice. That's it's just hard to believe that I'm the last one here. Oh. I never thought it would end like this. It makes you wonder what the whole point was in the first place. A note of ambition. Out of everyone on this earth, our families were the only ones who took the water crisis seriously. We were the ones who started building. We were mocked and thought we were insane. We were the ones who thought, uh, who everyone looked to when the lakes and ri rivers dried up. Our bl blueprints were the ones that were stolen as people became des desperate. Out of everyone on this earth, we are the ones who deserve to survive. The clouds are brimming with liquid life, but are still so evasive. We've been building for a long time, but we're not done yet. We have far farther to go. We will climb the clouds. Son of Chilkar. Debbie, diary page 490. This evening Kevin made a really cheesy speech about how we alone will prevail and how we are the only de descendants of the great ones who deserve life. It was honestly the cringiest speech I ever heard, and that's really saying a lot considering the other stuff he's been saying lately. He also keeps referring to himself in the third person, and only responds to us if, if we call him Son of Chilkar. Crazy! Let me tell you. And we, we can't even try to open that door. Wait. Nope, can't take that. Can I climb the ladder? Nope, can't climb the ladder, so use the stairs. You know what would be creepy? Seeing like something going up there, then there, and coming like here. Oh, oof. that would be bone chilling. I personally would hate that. Okay, anything here? Oh, stack of blanks. Nothing else. Do we need to fix something else? Oh, we are building the stairs. Okay. How many blanks do I have? What am I doing here? Exactly. Oh. Oh. Uh. This place really is beautiful. Even with the dust storms, it's peaceful in a way. I've been working on that tower my whole life and never once stopped to appreciate what we'd spent our lives building. We only looked up to the clouds, hoping we'd someday reach them so we could prolong our lives. But now that everyone's gone, I know any attempt I might make at accomplishing that would be futile. Rather than spending the rest of my life building a tower, maybe it's time I took a break. It's been a long time, but I think I'm finally done. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my. 
I think. Oh. It's raining. Oh, thanks for playing. Okay. Uh, kind of weird ending, but that was a nice little game. It was like a small story. Maybe it was done for like getting you think about how the future is gonna be like climate change and stuff like that. These guys have no water, so they have to build these tall towers to get to the water. I still don't know how they would get it from there, but yeah, so think about it. What do you do to make the future better place? But yeah, it was kind of good. I enjoyed it. Short little game. But yeah, that's all for now. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.